Good morning and welcome back. Today I am just going to show you my new high speed blender. Now, <clears throat> um, this obviously is not anything in comparison to say a Vitamix or a Blend Tech because I got it from Lidl. It's their brand, which is Silvercrest, and it was $69.99. This is the box it came in, okay? But I wanted to try it out because I've been considering getting a high power blender for a while. They'd looked at the, the Vitamix and the Blend Tech and also some of the others, and they were all in well over £250, sometimes up to £500, even £600, some of them. And I just thought it's such a lot of money for something that I really don't know if I'm going to get the benefit, you know, if I'm going to use it in such a way that it justifies that amount of money spent on it. Anyway, what I've found with Lidl and Aldi is they tend to be quite um, up to date, so they know what seems to be the latest trend and they'll bring it out in their own brand at a fraction of the price. So I did a little bit of research. I don't know loads about blenders. Please um, understand that. It just, um, you know, it was just me thinking, you know, actually these do look as if they would uh, they'd be beneficial because I make such a lot of smoothies and juices and things. Anyway, it's 2000 watt, which I believe is more than the Vitamix, or certainly some of the Vitamixes, which are 1,800. Um, let's have a look. 3,200 RPM, and it did say something about, it's, it's something like, here we are, looked, um, where is it, up here, 2.7 horsepower motor. And when I compared that to some of the really expensive ones, I thought it seems to be on a par, and yet it's 69.99. So I've tried it out, I bought it yesterday. These were launched, the reason I'm posting this video today is because these came out in Lidl in the UK yesterday. So that was the 4th of September, today being the 5th, they should still have them in. Um, and I'm telling you, in case you wanted to give one a go. So I blended up a, a smoothie here. I make my smoothies with green tea because I don't like drinking it. So if, if it's in a smoothie, cold, then I uh, don't tend to taste it. Uh, frozen banana, frozen berries, frozen pineapple and a chunk of ginger in there and this is it, it just got so fast and so powerful that I actually thought it was going to take off so what I'm going to do is just give it a quick whiz to show you how powerful this is and then I'll switch it off okay so down here you've got um you you can use this to vary the speed yourself or you turn it to m which I just thought it meant manual but it's, it's doing it for you anyway if you've got ice you've got this button and if you make it a juice you've got this button this is the one i pressed for juice and honestly this is it was crazy okay so are you ready for this oh what have i done wrong? let's switch it off and back on again flash is blue look fast loud admittedly it's gonna wake the household up if you're having a, a your smoothie at 6am but it was seriously fast and it just obliterated all the frozen fruits and um, I'm really really impressed with it so if you don't want to fork out upwards of 250 350 even 600 pound for a, a um, high power blender then and you live in the UK then I would suggest giving this a try because for 70 quid you know even if you don't find that you use it to its full potential it's not really any more expensive than just a regular blender that you would use um, anyway so i'm quite chuffed with it and maybe in a year's time i'll let you know how it's standing up um whether it's still you know doing the job but it's got a two-year guarantee so it should last me at least two years and to be honest if after two years it's had it i think for 70 quid other than the fact that I'd be really disappointed of the impact on the environment to be throwing this away after two years. But from a financial point of view, um, I'm really chuffed with it. It's also, um, okay, the jug is plastic, not glass, which is a shame, but it's BPA free. So, and my husband said to me, I thought you didn't buy plastic, that got, got, contains plastic, but I said to him, you know, it's not like I'm buying it and throwing it away. I'm still educating him that we don't want plastic that we're gonna buy, use once or twice and then throw away. Hopefully this will be used for years and years and years so thanks for watching see you again soon bye bye